report. Now Chief Meteorologist David Carnes joins us live to let you know what you can expect tonight. David? Uh, yeah, looking at uh, just a quick picture of uh, the backside of Signal Mountain, we'll start there because here in the Tennessee Valley and surrounding areas, it was actually very picturesque with very minimal damage or interruption to life. So we're doing pretty good. This is from Callie Starnes sending this picture in. Beautiful combination of water and snow. Always looks good there. If you have a picture, you can send it into weather at local3news.com and yeah, we might uh, try to get that on for you. Tuesday morning, it is going to be colder. We'll be in the upper 20s and there may still be some patchy areas of ice, particularly up on the plateau where we had some really significant uh, snow, anywhere from four all the way up to nine inches and more of snow falling there. So still going to be a problem for untreated surfaces tomorrow morning. Uh, we're going to see it warming Tuesday afternoon into Wednesday and late Wednesday we'll get some rain moving in and that rain may even transition into some light snow showers again on Thursday morning for our commutes. That might be an issue. Right now it's 36 in Chattanooga. Very chilly as we wrap up the day and head into the evening hours. Winds out of the west at 9 miles per hour making it feel like it's in the mid to upper 20s across the Tennessee Valley. So very chilly indeed. Dress in layers if you're going out this evening. Our clouds radar combined not showing anything. You can see how that low pressure now well off to the northeast and as you saw a moment ago, providing them with lots and lots of problems. But here it's just cloud cover and cool air that's going to be sliding in through the evening hours. And then as we head into Tuesday, we'll start with some clouds. But then after that cold start tomorrow, notice these southerly winds, these red warm southerly wind arrows pointing northward and that means that we're going to see temperatures beginning to warm up. So didn't get out of the 30s today. We'll get into the upper 40s tomorrow and then Wednesday we'll get even warmer. We'll have highs climbing to about 53 on Wednesday afternoon and that is ahead of our next front that is going to bring in that rainfall Wednesday evening into Wednesday night and the slow moving low notice on the back side of it. Once again, we see it mixing with that cold air and that's going to provide another round of wintry weather from Memphis to Nashville it won't be as heavy or as, as uh, strong as the last system over the weekend, but it will provide some snow, some ice uh, for our Wednesday night in Middle Tennessee. Here in Chattanooga Wednesday night, it's just a cold rain, but that colder air coming southward may provide a light wintry mix on Thursday morning also. It's not going to last long. By lunchtime, everything is cleared out and we're just sitting in the middle of really cold air. Highs won't get out of the 30s on Thursday, Friday, or Saturday. And notice an area of low pressure working its way to our south on Friday and Saturday might bring some snow showers. We're really uncertain as to how far south or how far north that low will be, but that's another system that we are watching as well. Rainfall amounts on Wednesday. I think we're looking at about, oh, half an inch up to an inch, maybe even a little bit more of rain and snowfall. Uh, I don't think we're going to see too much more impressive amounts, maybe a quarter, maybe some isolated spots, another half an inch here and there as we move into Thursday morning and see that colder air starting to rush in. It's going to be cold enough tonight. We'll drop down to 28, mostly cloudy, freezing for everyone overnight, teens and 20s. And again, where we have areas of snow and moisture on the roadways, ice is going to be a concern for untreated surfaces. So sunny in the afternoon tomorrow. After that cold start, it'll be a nice afternoon. 49 the high, 47 Cleveland will get up to 50, making it up to 50 in Blue Ridge. And our storm alert seven day forecast showing that late day rain after the high of 53 on Wednesday. And then as that cold Older air moves in. Notice we'll be at 36 in Chattanooga on Thursday morning, but in the higher elevations, we're talking upper 20s and low 30s. So I'm not going to rule out some problems on the roadways in those higher elevations for Thursday morning either. And look at the high. It's only going to climb to 39 Thursday afternoon. That cold air stays in place Friday and Saturday. And again, we're watching that next low for maybe bringing in some additional snow showers for the end of the weekend, the beginning of the weekend. And it's going to stay pretty chilly right into Sunday and Monday, D.C.